in the age of continuing European exploration of South America, happening upon the diminutive rodents known as chinchillas would change the European garment industry forever. With their dense, thick, and lustrous pelts, these small animals immediately became highly sought after as coats for nobility in Europe, so much so, that they were nearly hunted to extinction by the end of the 19th century. With the Chilean government banning any further hunting of chinchilla rodents, a French rabbit breeder sought out a different solution, to produce a rabbit with a coat almost identical to the South American natives. By somewhat random chance, a blue doe and a goody buck of uncertain breed produced a litter that was then crossed with Himalayans and an English breed known as a black and tan. As early as 1913, the first chinchilla rabbits had been created, leading to their immediate adoption as a valuable and desirable garment material. Thanks to their uniquely colored, densely textured fur, chinchillas became the rabbit of choice for breeders across the United States and Europe. While World War II threatened to decimate any interest in their breeding, dedicated clubs of breeders and fanciers have kept the breed alive to this day. The standard chinchilla is a domesticated breed of rabbit that was bred to be one of the larger types of pet bunnies anywhere in the world. As the name suggests, these are the standard varieties of the chinchilla breed and are considered to be the base from which all other varieties of chinchilla are bred from. Known to be a large breed of rabbit, the standard chinchilla is actually smaller than many of the other gigantic chinchilla varieties that are bred from it. One of the more popular breeds in the entire world, Standard Chinchilla, holds a special place in the history of the American Rabbit Breeders Association and is considered to be a very important variety due to how these heavy and stocky rabbits became cornerstones for other popular breeds and varieties. Standard Chinchillas may have been bred as domesticated pets, but they are also meant to be as big and as stocky as they are for exhibition and for commercial purposes as well. They are often a top choice for rabbit meat in places where rabbits are common delicacies. However, most breeders tend to breed these rabbits for domestic purposes instead of for the value of their meat in the open. Physical Description Standard chinchillas have the common appearance that most domesticated rabbit breeds have. However, they do have their own uniqueness in terms of their physical attributes in the sense that these medium to large size rabbits tends to be quite sticky, heavy, plump, or fat. These rabbits can weigh as heavy as more than 13 pounds due to their overall stockiness and plump body build. The coat of a standard chinchilla tends to be quite soft and smooth compared to other domesticated breeds of rabbits. They do not have the thickest coats and are pretty easy to take care of as far as grooming is concerned because they pretty much take care of their own coats without too much trouble on your part. Standard chinchilla usually has a color that is quite grayish or even bluish in appearance. The grayish coloration is more abundant and of a darker shade on their backs but tends to get lighter as it fades to the belly side of the rabbit. Their ears tend to have the same shade as their back. Some would even go on to say that the standard chinchilla has a color that's similar to a mix of salt and pepper due to the dark and light shades that are scattered all over its body. Overall, standard chinchillas have an appearance that is quite similar to the more popular American chinchilla breed. But the difference between these two varieties of chinchillas is that the standard one tends to have a more compact body build because it does not have the same overall length as the American variety, which is considered to have a longer body build. Personality Similar to most other popular breeds of domesticated rabbits that are recognized by the Arba, the standard chinchilla has a very friendly, open, and sweet personality that makes it an ideal pet rabbit to have for most households. They do not have the defensive personality or the shy demeanor that some other breeds have. In that regard, they are quite easy to get along with for children and adults alike due to how tender natured they are. In some cases, the standard chinchilla is also a bit docile towards its owner due to how it has gotten used to a life of domestication. It will submit to how its owner handles it and more than likely will not bother to try to struggle whenever you try to carry it. Some would say that its docile behavior is due to how its breed is also used to a life as an exhibition item or as commercial products that are sold for their meat and fur. Nevertheless, what you can never really take away from the standard chinchilla is the fact that it is a rabbit that is very friendly. It loves hanging around and socializing with its owner or family and will not hesitate to show its sweet and quite compassionate side towards anyone who is also just as sweet and as friendly as it is. The good thing about the standard chinchilla's sweet and friendly side is that it is quite calm and good-natured. It does not show a personality that is overly playful and open but is more or less always in control of how friendly it is towards its family. In that sense, this makes it a good rabbit to have for children or for senior citizens as they do not have a very hyperactive personality. Lifespan Standard chinchilla is more or less the same as any other breed of domesticated rabbits in the sense that these bunnies are used to a captive lifestyle and are more than likely going to live for about 5 to 8 years on average. 
They get to live longer than their wild counterparts due to how there are not a lot of life-threatening factors in captivity such as bacteria, infections, and natural predators. When taken care of properly and given a proper diet that is coupled with exercise, the standard chinchilla may live to reach the age of 10 but are more than likely going to have a maximum lifespan of about 8 years even when given the best kind of care they deserve under captive care. Reproduction Standard chinchillas reproduce in a similar fashion as other domesticated breeds of rabbits. At about 4 to 5 months old or even as early as 3 months, they will be mature enough to be ready for breeding. Simply introducing a male to a female will be enough to induce breeding so long as the female is receptive enough. These rabbits will more than likely be able to reproduce multiple times in a single year due to how quick the gestation period is. Most standard chinchillas will be able to give birth to a clutch size of about 2 to 5 baby rabbits. Behavior One of the best things about the standard chinchilla is that it is a well-behaved and good-mannered pet rabbit that is great as domesticated pets for children and seniors alike. They are not overly energetic or hyper and will most likely match your energy level when it comes to interactions between you and the rabbit. Their behavior can also depend on how you treat them. So, if you approach them in a mild manner, they are more than likely to show the same kind of energy towards you. As docile and quite submissive animals, the standard chinchilla does struggle whenever you try to approach, handle, or carry it. It is quite submissive towards the way you handle it and will not even bother to show any kind of negative emotion towards you. That is why they make for great pets for those who love to carry and handle rabbits. Even strangers will be able to handle them with no problem whatsoever. Standard chinchillas are not the most playful rabbits due to how calm their temperament tends to be. These rabbits do not move around a lot even when left alone out in the open when taken out of their cage. At times, they may show a kind of playful side if you try hard enough, but they are generally well-behaved animals that are not overly playful in any sort of way. This can be a problem for some owners as standard chinchillas can be prone to obesity and are not the most active types of rabbits when you want them to have some exercise. Standard chinchilla is a perfect pet to have for different types of owners due to this kind of behavior and temperament. Because they are not as big and as heavy as the usual American or giant chinchillas, they make good pets for children and for the elderly. The standard chinchilla is furthermore distinguishable from other chinchilla breeds by its pearly eye bands, forming white circles around its dark eyes. Smaller and more compact than the other two chinchilla breeds, standard chinchillas are slightly more delicate and fragile than their descendants. This, combined with their mild nature, makes them very suitable as pets for owners with previous rabbit handling experience. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.